It's a big week for the city of Detroit. 10,000 people fill Cobo Center for the NAACP National Convention. Earlier today, convention speakers aimed their remarks directly at the White House and President Trump. Paula Tutman joins us live from Cobo. Paula, I guess the rhetoric heated up pretty quickly. Yeah, I'm going to say that's kind of an understatement. So let me just kind of set the scene for you, what's going on right now. This is Derek Johnson, and he's the national president of the NAACP, who, by the way, happened to have been born in Detroit and is from Detroit. Also, uh, national board members are being voted on. So uh, also the plenary session or the opening volley is to get voting members of the NAACP fired up to go back to their communities to work for the advancement of people of color. As you said, lots of speakers today. Senator Debbie Stabenow with the fiery delivery of a Baptist preacher. Congresswoman uh, Brenda Lawrence with tears in her eyes. Interestingly enough, the guest of honor is here in name only as every speaker, including Governor Whitmer and Speaker Nancy Pelosi, took dead aim at the White House without cushions, without gloves, but bare-knuckled, pointed words against what they believe is the systematic attack of people of color from the White House. This is a critical moment in our history, as we all know. And once again, the leadership of the NAACP is needed. Donald Trump has given permission to people who used to hide under sheets in the dead of night to now stand in the light in front of a microphone. This is wrong. This is wrong. And this is our moment. I'm not going nowhere. Not until I impeach this president. So the theme of the 110th NAACP convention, when we fight, we win. And you have to imagine a lot that was said today, definitely fighting words, uh, basically, again, uh, getting others to get together, to vote, to get people involved in this. Um, and I would say that they were some pretty strong words today. Certainly not words I don't think I've ever heard at an NAACP convention, Steve. Yeah, thank you, Paula. Uh, the convention continues through Wednesday evening, and you can find a schedule of events and much more information on our website. That's clickondetroit.com.